Ed Morse out of Moted Group of Missouri, with locations in Lebanon, St. Robert, and Rolla, proudly presents Ozark Traditions TV. Closed captioning for Ozark Traditions TV is brought to you by Adam Williams of Show Me Dents. Sunrise, dew is on the field. Birds are singing, welcome back, my friend. As I look around at nature's majesty, I thank God that I live in this land of the free. Those are traditions in the great outdoors. Hunting with my family, who could ask for more? Planting seeds of passion like those who've gone before. Those are traditions in the great outdoors. Wandering down a riverbank or walking in a field. Hand in hand with my kid, it's not. Ozark Traditions TV is brought to you by Ed Morris Automotive Group of Missouri, Shadles Colonial Chapel, Redneck Blinds, Backwood Sportsman, and 4D Home Solutions. Welcome to another exciting episode of Ozark Traditions TV. On this week's show, we have team member TJ Schlipp as he bow hunts during the Missouri archery season. All right, guys, well, the long wait is over. It's the opening night of the 2020 Missouri archery season. And actually, it's pretty cool out here. It's usually 100 degrees, but tonight it's pretty nice. So me and Matt jumped up here all summer long I've been getting pictures of some good bucks in this little field. It's kind of like a transaction going into this bigger bottom field. They gotta hang out up here, but past week, of course, they've kind of went nocturnal on me. But we're hunting, that's what all we're worried about. All right, Doe comes by, she might be in trouble. We, we like eating those deer meat and stuff, so. Anyways, stick with us, hopefully we kill us a big buck or Maybe shoot a doe, nothing else. I know we're going to have a good time, so stick with us. We'll see what we can get done. Thank you for watching Ozark Traditions TV. TJ and Matt caught some movement off to their left. It was a young buck feeding along the edge of the field. We'll be right back with more Ozark Traditions TV right after these messages. 
Lindsay Chevy and Lindsay Ford are now Ed Morris Chevrolet and Ed Morris Ford of Lebanon. Hello, I'm David Bean, General Manager, and we're proud to be joining the Ed Morris team. I'm Teddy Morse, and my family has been saving folks money on vehicles for over 75 years, and we'd love to do the same for your family. While we have a new name, we still have the same friendly staff that you've come to know and trust. Join the millions who have already been backed by Morse and visit us today. So come see us, Ed Morse Chevrolet and Ed Morse Ford. Losing a loved one is painful, but at Shadles Colonial Chapel, we make the hard times a little easier to bear. With affordable funeral and cremation services, we offer two spacious chapels, a full-service banquet area for families to gather, plus the latest technology for honoring your loved one. Our website has everything you need, from pre-arrangements to flowers, even a place to reminisce. Let us help you remember your loved one. Shadles Colonial Funeral Chapel, the area's most often selected funeral service. Ozark Traditions TV is brought to you by Adam Williams of Show Me Dance, Radiance Safety Apparel, Napa Auto and Truck Parts with locations in Lebanon, Rolla, and St. James, Missouri, Natural Ag Solutions LLC, and Drag Time Extreme Deer Magic. Seems like a lot of times a buck shows up right at last light, and wouldn't you know it, tonight's one of them nights. Well, me and Matt 
This is the third day. It's September 17th. We've changed locations. We got in here in the timber. That deer, we've been hunting a field edge the past couple days and they've just been getting out there too late. So we moved down the timber, in the timber that the bucks were coming from. We're in here probably eight, 900 yards. Got this nice little oak flat. There's white oak tree, acorns falling everywhere. There's five or six fresh rubs right here. So we're hoping we're kind of being a little bit aggressive for early season, but we got other hunters on this farm and the pressure starts to pick up. So we're trying to get her done as quick as we can. So we're going to set her out tonight. Hopefully they start coming through here a little earlier than they have been in the field. So it may not be a lot of footage. It might be kind of quick in here, but we'll see what happens. Stick with us. Thank you for watching Ozarks Traditions TV. We'll be back with more Ozark Traditions TV right after these messages. When storms happen, call 4D Home Solutions before your adjuster and let us check your roof. We promise to call back within 24 hours. Don't panic because we have your roof interests covered. Call 4D Home Solution at 531-0635. 4D Home Solutions is a family operation who always return your call and show up when we say so. Call 4D Home Solutions before you call anyone because we value your roof as much as you. Call 4D Home Solutions at 531-0635. Closed captioning for Ozark Traditions TV is brought to you by Adam Williams of Show Me Dents, your auto hell repair professional. Why settle for less when you can get the best at Show Me Dents? Ozark Traditions TV is brought to you by Glory Knock, Rock the Knock, B&D's Custom Mounts, building custom mounts for the average sportsman, Inventive Outdoors, Deer Crossing Archery and Post Pond, more than just a pond store. All right, guys. Well, man, Matt's had enough. <laughs> We've been hunting hard. It's about the sixth day of the season, seventh day, something like that. Seventh day. <sighs> Missed a really nice buck opening night, and then since then, it's pretty much went downhill. So. This farm I'm hunting, the guy's got a couple separate pieces of property, and this is about a 50 acre spot right here. We got some big old white oak trees. Well, every time we drive by this field every evening, there's seven or eight does standing right here under this tree. So me and Matt come in through this blind up in 30 minutes here, brushed her in. We're just hoping one comes in range because we're, we're ready to kill something. It's a long walk from the truck. We're about 75 yards from the truck so but that's okay we're out here to try to kill us a doe tonight or you know big buck decides to try to get up in here we'll definitely shoot that too so stick with us we're out here just hunting tonight which that's all those our traditions is about guys it's just hunting we don't care if you shoot monster bucks we don't care if you shoot forked horns i mean we got a guy over here dozing the timber <laughs> off <laughs> But we're just hunting. We just love to hunt, so stick with us. Hopefully we'll kill a doe. We'll have something to eat. Thank you for watching Ozark Traditions. With deer starting to move in the guy's direction, all TJ needs is a mature doe and shooting range.
folks, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more Ozark Traditions TV right after these messages. The wonderful thing about Redneck Blinds is that every year we improve them by adding new features and accessories such as our new porch extension, ladder stabilizer, awning kits, magnetic curtain kits, acoustical foam panels, foam floors, green LED lights, and much more. Whether you want to upgrade your blind or purchase a new one, there has never been a better time. Visit redneckblinds.com and experience the Redneck Advantage. Hurry, everything is on sale now. Welcome back to OTTV. After having several deer walk past the blind, TJ finally has a doe right where he wants her. So we're going to walk over here. It's, it's kind of a hill, so I'm not expecting to find my arrow very easy. <laughs> but we think she just went down here to the bottom of the hill. So let's go down there and see if we can find some blood or something. See if we can find this. All right, guys. Well, it took us a little longer to find her than we thought. We went back and watched the footage, and as you can tell, is a little farther back than we thought and she just wasn't bleeding. So we left her alone for a couple hours and come back out here. We ended up just kind of doing a body search. We couldn't find any blood. It come out a little far back, but we got her found, big doe, awesome night. Gage Mashburn, he's back there somewhere. He come out and helped us. I gotta give him a shout out. He came out and helped us get her out of here and helped me drag her up the hill. So ought to be a good one for the grinder, but we're finally on the board. Me and Matt was getting a little nervous there. I know it's only seven days deep, but man, we've been hunting hard trying to kill a deer and finally got it done. The deer are hitting acorns right now and it's just tough, but we made it happen. And we got a deer killed and that's what we're all about here at Ozark Traditions is just having fun with your buddies and you know what, we're just as happy to kill this doe. I mean, obviously we want to kill big buck, but these does are just as fun to hunt and they eat a little better if you ask me. So. We're gonna get back after it. I think it's Matt's turn now. He's been... Thanks guys for letting us tag along with you on your hunt. 
From all of us at Ozark Traditions TV, we thank you for watching. And remember, if you see us out in God's country, stop us. We'd like to meet you. My family, who could ask for more? Planting seeds of passion like those who've gone before. Ozark Traditions in the great outdoors. Wandering down a riverbank or walking in a field. Hand in hand with my kid, it's not about the kill. Those are traditions in the great outdoors. Hunting with my family, who could ask for more? Planting seeds of passion like those who've gone before. Those are traditions in the great outdoors. Those are traditions in the great outdoors.